I'd just like to introduce you to two uh, entities, actually. The first one being the Grid Orchestra. If you could give them a round of applause, please. And, and the second one, if you could please give an equally loud round of applause to Nicola Bernadetti, the festival director. everyone, how are you doing? Good. It's such a huge, huge pleasure to welcome you all here. This is the second day of our opening fanfare of the International Festival and um, you can't imagine how many friends I have on stage. It's just incredible to have the Grit Orchestra here. Um, I just wanted to say a few words before we continue with what you're all here for, which of course is the music. Um, yesterday we had an extraordinary day here um, where we had 15 ensembles from all over Scotland, community making ensembles, um, to bring together all its glory over the last week. I think there's no greater demonstration but here and now is the place where that is alive and well. <laughs> What am I saying next? Um, just that this whole weekend has been overwhelming and unbelievably heartwarming. I'm so thrilled to have you all here. I don't think I want to say anything else other than my great friend, Greg Lawson. I can't wait to hear this performance. Please give a huge warm welcome to Greg Lawson and the Great Orchestra. Thank you.
before we do the next number, I just want to tell you a little bit about this group, what this group represents, and also how that kind of fits in with Nikki's kind of vision of community. And I don't mean community in some kind of glib way, but the gentleman of the uh, Chapel Choir in Glasgow, the back there, and assembled wonderful sopranos and elders from the Royal Concert of Scotland. This next track is called, uh, what is it called? It's called No Regrets. Uh, you'll be required to sing at the very end. I'll turn around and give you a cue. You'll have heard the refrain loads of times, so there's absolutely no excuse for you not to have picked it up and join in. And when you sing, and you'll be singing the words, no, no regrets, right? Make sure you get the T, otherwise it turns out no regrets, which is not quite as profound, all right? Being displaced from their homes, Another thing, another ethic, another thing that we have to deal with. It still happens, people displaced, people not respected, all because they're different. This one is called I. It's got nothing to do with any of those things. It's much more lighthearted, and it features wonderful Innes on a telephone over in the corner here, stage right. <laughs>
scales my face and she pulls off my hair and Elne bide with my granny name El awa him to my mother awa El awa him to my mother awa She keeps a wee shop at the top of the hall and she sells a wee drappy at sixpence a jowl. Sixpence a jar. 